episode. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Philadelphia Auto Show, and thanks for joining me here on the Lexus floor. You all are in for a real treat today, because I guarantee this is the first time you've ever seen this vehicle. It was just debuted in Australia in October, and this is the second version of this amazing concept car. The first version was unveiled in Detroit last year, just about 12 months ago, and this is the second version. This is called the LFLC, it stands for Lexus Feature Luxury Coupe. Now, it is a concept vehicle, but as I like to say, it's part concept, part reality. Concept, because it's not a production vehicle, and there are no known plans for production, but reality, because it actively lets Lexus engineers study how they can actually create this car if they wanted to bring it to life in the future. So, like I said, it's a uh, coupe, two doors, four passengers, two in the front, two in the rear, and uh, the exterior color is called opal blue. You may think they match this Lexus, Lexus emblem to match the exterior paint, but that's actually false. But here's a little fun fact for you. Whenever you're driving down the road and you see a Lexus emblem in blue, that automatically means it's a hybrid. And yes, this car is a hybrid. It's actually a front-mounted engine, rear-wheel drive hybrid that's estimated to get 500 horsepower. Not that for a Anytime it has a blue all. emblem on a Lexus, so it's a hybrid. let's here at the front of the car. I'll tell you a little bit about the design of it. So we added this spindle-shaped grille here. I want to get it's considered the, the new of face of Lexus, and all of our models from here on out film. will have the grille. We also added these LED running daytime lamps in the L shape, L for Lexus, of course, as well as the LED headlights with a really futuristic feel, and the fog lamps there for added visibility with a fading dot matrix for um, a sense of movement. So if you come toward the side of the car here, you notice these huge wheels. These are 21 inch wheels. We also have these huge air scoops here, these air vents, which are not only incredibly stylish, but they're very functional as well. They help cool down those massive Bembo brakes that we have on the LFLC. So if you come toward the rear of the car, you'll notice a sort of full circle approach that we have here. A lot of the design elements in the front of the car, you can also find in the rear as well. So the spindle shape, spindle shape uh, here on the rear really emphasizes that width of the LFLC. And the tail line, tail layups really emphasize depth. Look how... No, you're good. Go ahead. I edit. 